for one, death for the other, and all decided in an instant. But the outcome masks a battle that is very finely balanced. The eagle can't afford any mistakes. Even the slightest injury could leave it too weak to hunt and cause it to starve. This fear of injury is something the hare can exploit. It has a choice of tactics, either to run or hide. If it runs, it can dodge or just stop suddenly. Timing is critical. This hare decides to stop. It's too risky for the eagle to change course. So the hare's gamble pays off. Second option is to dodge. Dodge downhill and the eagle can turn, follow and kill. But dodge uphill and the hare often gets away. What the eagle is afraid of is dangerous wind turbulence from the ground hitting its lower wing. With the eagle almost upon it, the hare turns uphill. The eagle cannot follow and is forced to land. Eagles spend hours intently scanning hillsides. With eyes up to eight times sharper than ours, they can pick up the slightest movement. This is to combat the hare's second strategy, which is to hide. Again, the eagle fixes on its prey. This time, the hare has seen trouble coming and sinks down for safety. But then it can't see what the eagle is doing, which is a problem. The eagle takes its advantage. Neither can the eagle see the hare, however, as it sneaks uphill. A last minute change of position has saved the day. Fearing injury, the eagle is unable to change its final approach. The hare is safe. It will now run just a short distance away. An eagle grounded is no longer a threat.